The American Association of State Highway and Transportation Officials, AASHTO, has been an industry leader since its founding back in 1914 at the dawn of the nation's highway system. And for the first time in its history, a woman sits one chair away from the very top. Susan Martinovich, elected AASHTO Vice President for 2010. I'm really excited and I think that the opportunities that the other western states have given me in, in selecting me to be in this position, I'm just very proud and honored. What's the best tool that we have to make it Martinovich happen? has worked hard charting a path to the top. Well, I would say you go, girl, to, to Susan. Um, I'm excited to have uh, a woman uh, uh, assume that role. You know, I think uh, we've been a male-dominated um, industry, so I think it's an important step for Ashto to have one of our women CEOs do it, and I can't think of anybody better than Susan. She brings both the engineering background and the administrative uh, savvy uh, to her job. I'm excited, and I think she'll do a great job uh, for Ashto. Martinovich, a licensed professional engineer, credits her success to a good foundation of family and education. She considers herself a role model not just for females, but for any young person considering a career in engineering. I grew up in Carson City, Nevada, which at that time was about 5,000 people, and you know had great childhood, great family, great friends, and went to high school and started in the math and science courses. I think there are more women going into engineering, but not that much. I look at the classes now that are graduating from the school I graduated from, University of Nevada in Reno, and there aren't that many more as a percentage, but that's also just for the magnitude of kids graduating from engineering, from especially my field is civil engineering. Martinovich began her career with NDOT in the late 1980s as a rotation engineer. She was soon promoted into the bridge division, designing several structures throughout the state. By 1993, Martinovich was working full-time as principal design engineer responsible for the early development of many of the major new freeway projects now under construction in the state. In 1999, she was promoted to the director's office as assistant director of engineering responsible for six pre-construction engineering divisions, including design, safety and environmental. In 2003, Martinovich was promoted to Deputy Director, Chief Engineer, assisting the Director in the daily operations of the department. Then in 2007, she took over the department as NDOT Director. I knew the department and I believe that the Department of Transportation and that just transportation agencies in general are the best agencies to work for. The, the passion and the dedication of the staff, no matter what they're doing, they want to come to work and do a good job. Martinovich says the transportation challenges she faces in Nevada are as varied as the state is wide. I think Nevada represents a snapshot of a lot of states. We have very large urban area, Las Vegas, one of the fastest growing cities in the nation. Um, big challenges along the I-15 corridor, goods movements, so we have a um, variety of challenges in Las Vegas. Very large and expansive rural areas. We're a big state, a lot of road to cross to get from one place to the other. We have temperature variations, large snows up in northern Nevada, extreme heat in southern Nevada, everything in between um, before. So we have some big challenges that we need to address that a lot of the other states do too. But our biggest challenge as an NDOT or as a Department of Transportation is getting the word out about what we do. Those who know Martinovich best use words like confident, experienced, passionate, and resolved to describe her. And despite the nation's current economic woes, she uses these words to paint an optimistic view of transportation's future. I think now is a wonderful and really exciting time. It's really easy to be a leader and do good things when things are going well. And I think now some great opportunities to push the envelope and to get something different and to really move forward for the sake of transportation. I'm excited. Susan Martinovich, Ashto Vice President for 2010. Profiles. 
is a production of Transportation TV.